To get started, we need to import some media, and there are a few different ways to do so in Vegas Pro. But even before we do that, let's make sure your Vegas Pro workspace looks like mine. Choose View, Window Layouts, Default Layout. This sets your Vegas workspace to the default configuration so you can easily follow along. Now click the Explorer tab. You'll notice this looks just like the Explorer in Windows, and it works basically the same way too. You can access all of your folders and hard drives from this window. You can also preview media files in the Explorer window. Once you find the file you want, drag it onto the timeline. When your media is on the timeline, we refer to it as an event. Events are simply containers on the timeline that contain media. Vegas subscribers have access to royalty-free stock video and audio through Vegas Hub. You can search for content, download it, and then use it in your project. All right, now for the fun part. To move an event, drag it earlier or later on the timeline to the position you want. To trim the start of an event, move your cursor to the left edge until you see the trim icon. Drag to trim the start of the event. Move your cursor to the right edge of the event to trim the end. To add a fade in, move your cursor to the upper left corner of the event until you see the fade icon, and then drag to the right. Release the mouse button when you're happy with the fade length. This works in the same way to create a fade out, and you can always adjust the length of the fade later. To split an event, click the event at the location where you want the split. This both selects the event and places your project cursor at the target split point. If you're not happy with your split point, drag the timeline cursor left or right to the proper location. Press the S key to split the event. This creates two separate events and you can now edit them independently. Editing functions like cut, copy, and paste also work in Vegas. Right-click an event and choose cut or copy from the context menu. Place your timeline cursor later in the timeline, right-click, and choose paste. So these are just a few basic but essential editing functions. There's a lot more to learn, but these basic techniques will allow you to get started editing in Vegas Pro.